to a huge storyline during this Arctic blast holiday travel. Yeah, with winter conditions spreading across the country, flights are falling like dominoes. KPS teaches Bill Baraha is live for us from Bush Airport tonight. Bill, it's only expected to get worse. Yeah, with each passing hour, there are more delays and cancellations right now here at Bush Airport. There are 266 delays and 50, rather 32 cancellations at Hobby, 153 delays and 33 cancellations. And that number, as you just mentioned, is expected to rise as the temperatures take a dip here locally in the city of Houston and across the country. Despite all of that, we are in Terminal A and things seem to be operating smoothly. You can see the uh, ticket counter lines behind me. Not a problem. The same can be said for the TSA say security lines. The Houston airport system says they expect 140,000 people to travel through Bush and Hobby today and tomorrow. They, of course, are monitoring the situation and are ready if there are any issues. They tell us they are working closely with their airline partners to ensure the least amount of operational disruption. A lot of that, though, would depend on other parts of the country. We also spoke with travelers who are experiencing some issues getting to their holiday destinations. We left Houston. We got at the airport at like 5.30 a.m., so we haven't been sleeping since. Been on a plane all day. Um, Where'd you guys go? We had a layover in Nashville, and uh, that's when they told us that our flight was canceled to Chicago. And I was like, well, <laughs> okay, I'm not trying to freak out. Um, and then just came back here to Houston. We had to fly back, and they were telling us that chances are for our flight because they rebooked us for tomorrow. Chances are that's not going to happen either. Uh, we're supposed to be flying out to uh, Nashville, Tennessee. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're going to a uh, uh, Texas game over there against Titans. And you, and you said you're experiencing some delays right now? Yeah, yeah, right now, I guess uh, it looks like it, about an hour. If we have really bad weather in, say, Chicago, that's going to have a direct repercussion here in Houston, right? It's a network of flights. And just some advice, if you are coming to the airport, your best bet is to get here early. Experts say pack smart to save time during TSA screenings. Monitor your flight through your airline so you can stay on top of any changes, delays, or cancellations. You can also count on us to keep track of those delays and cancellations. Live from Bush Airport, Bill Barajas, KPRC 2 News. Okay, Bill, thank you for the update out there.